Hey parents, thank you for watching this quick little video. I wanted to update you on what some of our big events are coming up for this hit pit season and our big events. Starting off with August 7th is our parents meeting, which is which is coming up. But um, our launch for the hit pit will be August 14th, which is our draft night. It's kind of where we divide up our groups are into teams. And uh, each month we want to do something special for our students. So like September 4th, we want to do loaded tea or October 30th, flannel fest. November 20th is Friendsgiving. And December 18th is our... Um, is our Christmas party. Unite Night. Unite Night is our strength, is our See You at the Pole rally, where we are, this year we're inviting Strength to Stand to come in. Strength to Stand will do worship, and they will have one of their speakers come in and do the message. This will also help promote an, a organization or a mission that they have going on next year. So that's going to be at the end of September, and if you've ever been a part of this, you know it's a phenomenal time. December, or January 18th through the 20th is going to be our winter retreat. This year we have gotten a cabin that's going to sleep around 40 people in all. This cabin is located kind of a little bit lower level, so hopefully we won't get snowed in if it does snow. But as we draw closer to this, um, I want you just kind of a few things is we will probably spend a little more time in the cabin this year. One of the main reasons we're going to the cabin is we're just trying to build some unity between our 7th grade, seventh graders all the way up to our 12th grade. This would be an awesome opportunity and as you saw there's a pool and there's there's a game room and stuff like that in the theater. So hopefully we'll, we'll have a large group sign up this year because over the past few years the numbers have dropped so it's time to do something a little different. We know the winter retreat is always fun, a lot of great things always happen. And so um, it's also just a fun time for worship. Our beach retreat this year is going to be at the end of the school year but over the course of Memorial Day weekend. This year I'm thinking about doing just high school only on this beach retreat. If I do allow both of them, um, you know, it, it'd be something just for our student ministry because I know the next week I want to take our middle schoolers to um, generate camp, which is similar to Student Life Kids Camp, which is something our, student, our children's ministry does quite often. If we do do this, um, it would be seventh or six through eight. We would allow our sixth graders to come to kind of get integrated into into what is, what life is like into our student ministry. Um, it's really game oriented and teams oriented, but it's a lot of late night activities and it's a lot of fun. But worship is always a huge factor in this, and so I think this would be a good way to start getting our younger students involved in how we do things around at this in the student ministry for Central Baptist. So that's through Generate Camp, and it's always phenomenal. Our last big event is the Montana Mission Trip. Just a couple of years ago, we went to New York, which was phenomenal. We took a good group. This year, I want to go to Montana. We'll be working on an Indian reservation and sharing the gospel, doing some backyard Bible studies at BBSs. So here's the last little events. Just kind of give you a quick little recap of what we have going on at the Hit Pit. Make sure to watch it, and um, I'll send this out. Thank you all.